So this is going to be a bit different from my usual videos. Ever since I started this YouTube channel, I've always held the belief that I should keep on constantly improving my videos. Either they be through editing, commentary, or the sheer quality of my videos. But with that sort of mindset, I've sort of hit a wall. Now that I'm constantly editing videos to the sheer level that even some big YouTubers dare not go to, I've also decided to start rendering my videos. In a different way too. Instead of rendering my videos with the same settings that I've used for the longest time now, I've decided to render them to such an extent to make the video have more color and contrast, and to make it look smoother as well. And I must say, with my latest video looking like Midas decided to give it his touch, I think it looks good. And I hope the rest of you agree, seeing as I'm typing this up before the video is even released. However, I actually hate rendering like this. Allow me to express the difficulties I had while trying to make the Resident Evil 7 finale. Not only did the first rendered version completely screw up and ruined the entire video, it also wasted two days of my life. It took two days to render. Two days of patiently waiting for this 10 minute video to look beautiful for you guys. However, when it was done, this was the result. I then spent two more days re-rendering everything, screwing up multiple renders, fixing errors that I found, before it finally looked okay, but it was worth it. The video looks great with minimal errors that only last a few frames before they're gone. However, some of you guys might not like it as much, and so I decided to put up a straw poll to see if you guys would like to keep the motion blur-like effect or get rid of it. You can find the link down below in the description. Now that that's out of the way, I would like to move on to a bit more serious topic of the video. As we move forward in this YouTube career thing, I would love to keep improving my video's quality, editing, commentary, rendering, and so on and so forth. And as such, from this day forward, I would like you, my audience, to criticize my videos to any extent that you would like to. Be it either on my commentary skills, editing, video quality, or so on. I know that I should probably stop at the level I'm at, because I am nowhere near famous enough to start worrying about quality. But I want the best for you guys. I know what I ask must not seem like much to you guys, but to me, it would mean the world. Alright, that was it for the video. I don't exactly plan to make many videos like this, so I hope a lot of you watch it. Thank you for watching this, and have a good time.